the city and his neighbors to allow him to keep his unusual pets, two pygmy goats. KSBY News reporter Angel Russell joins us now live at City Hall. So Angel, what seems to be the problem? Well, Grant, the problem is he doesn't have a permit to keep those pets, and he got a neighbor complaint. Now, pet goats are legal in the city of Pismo Beach. They've been legal since 2014 when another man urged City Hall to be able to keep his pet goats. You may know those goats now as the surfing famous goats here in Pismo Beach. Well, now resident John Hyatt is going to have to go through that same process. Come on, Daisy, man. Pismo Beach resident John Hyatt has a few chickens and two pygmy goats, but he'll tell you he has a lot more animal friends than that. Uh, there I have visitors of a couple little wild rabbits and a couple squirrel families. It's, it's, it's a lot of fun in the morning. He's lived in Pismo Beach for more than 15 years. He loves livestock because he grew up on a farm. And it's just nice to get back to that. You, the values, the life, the enjoyment of animals. Ten months ago, John Hyatt adopted these two, Billy Bob and Daisy May. But one day this summer, while he was gone, the goats got out. When they did get loose, I was in the hospital and uh, couldn't walk. I had my leg amputated. This led to a neighbor complaining about the goats, and the city realized Hyatt doesn't have a permit to keep them. There are two items that are lacking. It's an enclosure for the goats themselves, and then also uh, keeping... Uh, a couple of the other on-site animals also enclosed as uh, per requirement. I don't want to inconvenience the neighbors in any way. Uh, I'll do everything to mitigate. Hyatt plans to build an enclosure and is hoping people will visit his mini farm. That, that's, that's the main thing. I want to contribute to the community. And I want to set the facility up and have it basically open for anybody to stop any time. And... Whether or not Hyatt will be able to keep his goats is now in the hands of the city when neighbors set to speak at a public meeting Tuesday. There's consideration, there's no guarantee he would get approval, but uh, we will see tomorrow night. Well, the city will be considering that application tomorrow at 5.30 right here at City Hall. And of course, residents are encouraged to speak out. Live and local in Pismo Beach, I'm Andrew Russell, KSBY News. All right, very interesting, thank you. For all of that, Angel, and by the way, if you want to attend the meeting but can't, you can email the city. And switching gears now, Kelsey is in.